Okay, here's the worm. Feed him to a fish. Whoa. Man, he really took that bad boy. Cool. Gun. Fish will love it. Let's see what you got. Wow, that's pretty good. Can I see what you have in the bag? This is what she picked already from the back. Okay. Do you have any okra in your garden you're going to pick? Yeah. Wow, these peppers are looking nice. Okay, three there. Packed pretty close together. Now he loves picking the okra. First thing she wants to do when she comes home is pick okra. She's like that too. There's a small one, so man, you pick them pretty small. You're all the same type of okra, too. Baker's Creek. Big hitter. Wish well, she's getting some good ones. Well, these are really growing great. These are the ones I planted. I only meant to plant six, but I ended up doing double that. I planted 12. And they all survived. They all just are growing so well. There you go. You're picking them kind of small. If you waited till tomorrow, those would get like double the size, huh? Sure, like that. Yeah, like that. That's the perfect size. Yeah. Don't break it off. Whoa, that's pretty decent. There's my first parsnip, huh? Okay. Thank you. Not very big. I'm just gonna leave them in there. I'll put cherry here. Plant. Oh, I see it. Oh, it's a tomato worm. See, he's so afraid. Oh, he bit me, Nelly. Ow, oh, he's biting me. Yeah, he's biting me. Kind of freaking me out. Big tomato worm. She hates these bugs. I'll feed them to my fish. My fish love them. It's a big one for them. He's eating the parsnip. Then I'll just put him down. See, she's so afraid I can't even be close to her with this worm. I'll get him later. I still have him. <laughs> so what, you have anything over here to pick? Oh, you're picking pepper too. This isn't just an okra picking video. It's a pepper picking video. The rain. The rain is Here's the, the pepper garden. My wife helped me plant. 
It's not doing nearly as well as her peppers, but we are getting peppers here. Jalapeno peppers, sweet peppers. That's it, just those two. There's a pepper. Can I see it? That's pretty small, but pretty. There's a bunch of nice ones here. Whoa, another nice one. No, don't pick the one. It's not, it's not ready. Don't pick it. They're ready when no. you want to pick them. Don't pick it, don't. Let it get big. This one is nice. Going bad. How about some of these red ones? This one? Yeah, I don't want it. If you don't want them, they got bug damage. Mm. She's very sensitive to the stink bugs, just like that one. Look at that one over there. I was looking at these. No, this are small. By the time they're the right size, you're going to forget them. No. This one? Yep. Because of the bug damage, so. Over here. It's, I think it's the heat. The heat damage too. Oh. How about this one? Yeah, heat damage too. Pick but, it? Um, yeah, sure. Let's see, I'll show you this one. See this one, the bugs are doing this. Mm. See the difference? All yep. That? Some discoloration. Okay, here's the worm. Feed him to a fish. Whoa. Man, he really took that bad boy. Cool. Gone. Fish will love it. Here's some frozen okra from Past harvest. We have lots of the we picked today. Sorry. And now he's making a gumbo. He made a roux with onion, some green pepper from the garden, and garlic. And that's the nice color that you want the roux. You can't really see the roux because you have some water too. So if you're just going to cut up all the okra and put in that frozen okra. Frozen okra is good too. You're going to cut it up and add it to the gumbo. Are you going to cut up all that okra? Mm -hmm. onion, garlic, and okra in the roux. And then she'll add some chicken. She just adds cooked chicken. It's looking good. Here's the frozen okra we've already picked, man. This is a pretty good sized bag. You gotta pick it every day. And yeah, the freeze is really nice. The back of the <clears throat> Here's my home cooked gumbo with fresh garden okra and some hot sauce on top. Chicken and rice. I'm going to be having a tasty dinner tonight. Thanks for watching my okra harvest video signing off